Server components are components that only run in, on the server or in the build and never on the client. And this means that we cannot use our familiar state, effects, and browser APIs or hooks inside them. And this can feel very restricting at first. Server components, however, are extremely powerful, and they can do a lot of things. For example, they can fetch data asynchronously um, and be async, and fetch data asynchronously right inside the component itself. Furthermore, since they're only run on the server, they can access backend resources directly and in proximity to the resource. Uh, for example, a database. And lastly, the JavaScript is never shipped to the client, which means that they reduce the bundle size and let us build more performant apps. Server components allow us to fetch and render on the server and then stream in the fully rendered components to the client as they complete while displaying a loading fallback with suspense. And this is beneficial because we are sharing the compute load between the server and the client, which is pretty incredible. 